you are struggling to place trade anytime you find it difficult to place a trade i want to show you this very simple strategy you can use no matter your your size no matter the the amount you are using if you can apply this it will help you i want to show you just very simple strategy you can use this thing on your smartphone you can also use it on your pc whatever you have any means you want to trade i'm going to show you in this video about skyping i will show you in this video about skyping all right in this video i promise that i'll be dropping something that will help you to be enjoying yourself and for you to be uh, at least taking some dollars with this strategy my aim of uh raising this uh, very strategy is for you to use it to raise your capital i mean yes your capital any amount you're using if you are careful enough once you have equity that can carry you to place your trade with these very simple tricks you can place it and you will simply make your profit so look at these things i'm going to show you and it's very very simple my name is gdfx um i want to say thank you to my subscribers thank you for my returning subscribers thank you for my new viewers thank you for all those who always support me and those who believe in me and i want to promise you that i will never take your patronage for granted in this video let's go down to the straight now watch this thing i'm making here now watch this thing here and watch what we have here look at it look at here you have two places to look at one two three four five six seven eight nine ten one two three four five six seven eight nine ten before this spike can you see it before this very spike so what are you looking at for this very strategy the zoom level you will be using is zoom tray the zoom level you are using is zoom tray all right you are to use zoom tray that is the zoom level you are expected to use watch here anytime you see this very thing here touch these 10 levels and you allow this one also to cross each other here there must be a cross here for you to make it there must be a cross here and another thing you should look out for is that the yellow line must be under and the blue must be like this so if the yellow is like this is getting ready are you getting it it's getting ready so anytime the yellow cross like it has happened here like it as it has happened here anytime the yellow cross like this but the first thing you must look out for is let there be let this uh aqua line aqua color here let it touch the 10 levels as it touch the 10 levels so as this one is fighting to come across this place you have the opportunity once this one has crossed this one once this thing has come across and touched 10 and crossed the yellow line it is a very good opportunity for you to enter your trade and one good thing about this is that if you can pay attention to this you can do this and i will tell you why one or two reasons why when you enter it why you may fail if you fail to watch this all right look at another opportunity here again look at another opportunity here but look at this one this one happened below 30 and as it happened below 30 look at what happened something happened here look at this thing here can you see it there was a spike here but the spike is not strong enough this is one minute time frame so for you to use this strategy you are to focus on one minute time frame and in this one minute time frame it is something that you can use and to use it to raise your capital now let me show you something that okay before that let me show you again let me show you it's something you can do often look at it look at another opportunity here look at another opportunity here. look at it here remember this one here that happened here this one didn't touch 10 and that is why you have one two three four five six before this one spike and this one spike to push it down look at it here this one spike to push it down to 10 and from there it took off and this is where it is now 
all right so look at it anytime you see a cross anytime you see this cross that the yellow has crossed the blue and the aqua has crossed the yellow line it is a good opportunity for you to place your trade i will show you why and how all right but i will tell you some few things that you should look out for each time you see a cross once you see those things you need to be very very careful now look at it again look at this one here look at this one look at it can you see it you have greater opportunity do you see it you have greater opportunity look at this one here again look at this one here so there is something i want you to know there is a video you will see below the screen here there is a video you will see that video will tell you how to use your time frame on the, um, i mean how to manage your zoom level look at these things look at it look at it can you see it look at this thing it's a very huge opportunity for anyone that wants to make profit i'm just showing you for skyping only i'm not talking about spike today i'm showing you now let me show you why when you place your trade using this very strategy why it may fail you look at it i'm going to show you why it may fail you when you place your trade believing that you should come up with at least five candles why you are trying to get to five candles why the market may spike number one reason is this when you use a zoom level look at this zoom level here now look at this zoom level this zoom level is at 90 now this one here is at 90 pointing to this very hundred here are you getting it now but when you zoom out now the same this thing that was at 100 here now at 90 here is now at this place are you getting it so when you place a trade with a wrong zoom level i mean even when you are back testing when you are back testing you discover that what was something that was below 10 is now on 90. so when you when you wrongly back test it or when you wrongly shifted your screen and unfortunately let me show you when you shifted your screen in this direction and the thing pointed to this place and you you shifted again and you shifted again the thing now back to this place do you see that it's a problem so once these things happen like this you will think that what should be at 90 now is is, is a certain so the market you should avoid because it's in 90 you entered it on 10 believing that it's going to skype so when that happen is a problem so one thing you should look at for anytime you want to place your trade in this very indicator one thing you should look at for is first thing look at the screen and also look at this place let me show you now let me show you look at it can you see it look at it look at it can you see it the cross here remains the cross and this is moving average 100 the market has touched on this way this is not my uh, object of discussion today now this thing has touched this thing has crossed here as it has crossed here it has the power to give you at least 10 to 5 candles or 15 candles are you seeing it so each time you want to place your trade be sure that the one on the main chart has crossed then the one on the this one has also crossed then there is something else you can do i'm talking about only skyping today there is something else you can do that can help you to stay in the trend for more than i mean you can take not less than 100 to 60 candles that there is something you can do that thing is possible when you step in using your one hour time frame are you getting it using a one hour time frame like you can see this one here now it's crossing this thing here you are seeing here now is crossing and another candle is moving up like this that you are trading on a higher time frame doesn't mean that it will not spike it will spike but since we have this thing now it's a good entry point for us to trade but for those who don't have enough equity one thing you need to do is to be patient until this thing will cross the 100 levels or you set your distance to have 50 moving average which will be somewhere here are you getting it so if this thing now can get to this point and cross this resistance level you have this here for tp and you have here for another tp then from here from here onward you now have a, a larger opportunity now let me show you another thing you can look at for look at this thing here can you see it it's pointing this very direction that is it that is it 
so if you watch what is going on here now you notice that even in, in a higher time frame that once you see something like this once your eyes can set on this you know from this um, down trend it get to this point and another movement started here so you see the market started here as it started here and it all ended here and another one the journey started here again and it's pointing to this direction so it nearly touched 70 but it didn't touch 70 so from there another thing want to move up like this you remember that since it stepped down from this 100 uh, moving averages um, it have not been able to come down to this very direction anymore so i mean it has not been able to go up from this very direction so one thing we are looking at for is once you see this uh, very color that cross this yellow line below the 10 in your higher time frame with this even though it will be spiking or spiking down spiking up but once you are able to discover it and enter look at it from here now here should be your stop loss you get that and here should be your first tp you know that so with this thing now the market will be fighting frustrating moving up and moving down so with it you will be able to take your profit and here is your first tp here is your second tp before the market will go down and even as that even if you are not around that to this place you still have something your the market didn't let that come back to losses and now it's still moving up which is this very thing here are you getting it so you have nothing to lose that is how market works and that is how simple it can be so each time you want to use this very strategy to trade please i'm begging you be careful to see these things like i said earlier one or two things you should look at for is this one one thing you should see is that there is going to be a cross here that's number one number two there's going to be a cross here once you see this thing then be ready to place your trade are you getting it be ready to place your trade secondly you know that it is 100 percent possible that market can be in uptrend in a higher time frame so if you are able to identify a possible entry point from a higher time frame it gives you more opportunity for you to trade remember that in the midst of 15 candles in your one minute time frame is because that a bullish candle is making a move in a higher time frame are you getting that and a, a 15 minutes candle is completing are you seeing it so 15 minutes candle is completing so that is one reasons all these things can happen so it's not something that you just woke up and you place your trade but with this thing i'm showing you here now you can be able to place your trade and make profit no matter the experience you have in your forex trading so do this and you will definitely make profit using this very strategy that is one promise i'm giving to you you can do it you can do it look at it you can do it so as this thing is opening here now and as it has crossed here now it's a very huge opportunity for someone to place trade very huge opportunity the only thing that person cannot do is to hold for long the only thing because this thing you are seeing here in this very one hour time frame now just this little thing here now has given us about let's just say okay let me just let me just show you it now look at it here now i'm placing this thing below this so let's go to one minute time frame and i'll still show you again look at it uh that thing is very far i'm coming uh it's very 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 far all right can you see it so before that thing will complete itself here you will notice that that little movement you are seeing here is this thing in one hour time frame in one minute time frame so before that candle will move up to a stand where the market may push it down you have already taken your five candles and you are out of the trade look at it i see it just taking five candles and from every indicator and from every indication here market is ranging can you see it market is ranging so this is just five minutes time frame and that candle i placed on one hour time frame is this candle here so at this candle is making a bullish movement you are taking one candle and you know that one candle here is five candles in one minute time frame so some of you struggling to take five candles in one hour in in your trade you can place trade and take five candles not when i have you 
as my student you can do it so please if you are struggling with those things that means you need attention and not just attention urgent attention but with this strategy you can do it and i've said earlier in just a little review i've said earlier why you may place it to take five candles unfortunately you may end up losing your trade is because when you back test or when you zoom if you zoom and the zoom you are using can be in a higher time i mean can be 90 why the factors is placing it on 10 levels so once you have that it will be difficult for you to understand how the market works but in this video i've been able to try to explain to you that some few things you look at for is once you see a cross here like like here now some will say that the market is always in backtest now listen look at it here so placing a trade here you can also trade it using your main chart only so but for clearer confirmation allow it to cross here so that even if it spike it will not get to your profit and nothing will happen to your profit all right so this is how simple it is okay this is how simple it is so let me show you the indicators very fast let me show you the indicators the yellow line you are seeing on the main screen on the main chart is seven though i will drop it on my description the yellow line you are seeing on the main chart is seven exponential apply to close are you seeing it apply to close apply to close the blue line you are seeing is 10 so the moving averages is 10 7 or 7 10 apply to close do you see what i'm showing you that time this thing has taken one two three four and the five is completed i'm saying for those who hardly take five candles whenever they are trading you find it difficult to place trade just use this strategy it will, it will give you something just wait for a cross and wait for another cross try it if you are not conversant with forest trading as that please use your demo account to do it even but you can do this not less than 20 times in a day once you decide to trade it's a very good opportunity all right so and this very one here is 100 moving average this one is 100 moving average these are the indicators on the main chart 100 moving average so the ones we have below here the yellow line is 12 moving average and this one is exponential moving average which is seven so both of them are the same thing so these things are the same thing so you can apply this and you see the magic my name is gdfs and please if you know you have not subscribed to my channel i want you to subscribe and you are free to watch other videos so that you can be able to grab the knowledge that will drop and remember that our intention is to help you raise money take care of yourself and also fight hunger and poverty around and if you're already rich to help you remain rich so that you will use forest as a business and if you're looking for mentorship gdfs is always there to assist you remember it's not free no business is free i don't do free business all right so thank you and stand by as we come up with other strategies see you and please feel free to comment to our channel if you have something to say okay thank you